Hi, in this video we're going to be talking about the Microsoft Edge sidebar. So this is a little toolbar here that you could use to kind of work uh, within your browser while keeping the same page open. So by default it's just kind of minimized off to the side here and it has some kind of default settings here, such as search, if you want to do a search for Bing, discover, you know, some shopping, tools, you know, calculator and clock and so on. And if you don't like it, you just close it back up. And if you want to do some Office Online, you could do that too. See your current stuff if you're logged in. And then if you have an Outlook account, you know, click on that. You could kind of check your email while keeping your uh, other browser window open here and check your mail and so on. Get your calendar and stuff like that. Compose a new mail. Check your folders. And then if you want to do something new, you click on the plus here. And so you can turn this stuff off, like I don't want to use this Discover or Shopping, just to clean it up a little bit. No games. And let's say I want to have my Gmail account here. I can do that. Now if I click on that, if you're not logged in, you'll have to log in the first time, but you got your email here. And you can see all your categories and so on. And compose a new mail. And if you want to pin it or unpin it, you can do so from here. Make it open in a, in a new tab. Got some other options for snoozing, for Gmail. Just like that. And then, you know, other stuff too. We have YouTube. And then you could add the current page. So let's say you want to have this page always available. Now let's say we're on another page. So let's say like uh, Google Docs here, for example. And we wanted to see this page here. We could have it open in our in our little sidebar and still view it, kind of like you would see on your phone. You know, the formatting is a little different, kind of scrunched up there, but you could still kind of navigate around and keep this open at the same time. And if you don't want to, just close it up. And if you don't want the sidebar, you could close it from here to hide it. And to get it back, you could click on the three dots here and look for Show Sidebar. And then there's some options here under the settings. This will take you to your browser settings. So here's your sidebar options here. You can turn it off and allow, allow sidebar apps to show notifications. Just like that. So that's pretty simple to use. You know, it's just a handy little feature if you want to you know, do common tasks without leaving your page and that kind of thing. So you, like I said, you should have this enabled by default. If you don't, go to your three dots up here. Look for uh, show sidebar, or in this case it's hide sidebar because it's already open, and then you should have it available to you. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.